everyone's got to go, y'all. Everyone's got to go. Um, Commanders get smacked 25 to 10. The score doesn't even tell the full story. Carson Wentz needs to be benched. Ron Rivera needs to get fired. Scott Turner needs to get fired. Everyone needs to go. Everyone is trash. Everyone needs to go. Um, This was just a bad game. And I got to give credit to the defense, though. The defense fought hard. They kept it close until the fourth quarter. But because Carson Wentz is the Cowboys' bitch and Micah Parsons' bitch, apparently, because when he felt Micah Parsons coming, he was like, no, 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 hit me here. I'll, I'll, I'll throw an attempt at grounding for y'all. Here, here's a gift. Throw it where there's no eligible wide receiver there. And you get penalty, and you make it second and long, third and long, what have you. Carson Wentz is trash. He needs to be benched. Um... Antonio Gibson did as much as he could. This run game did as much as they could. They carried a team, sad to say. The, the run game pl- came to play. The wide receivers... Um, Trayvon Diggs shut down Terry McLaurin. Jahan Dotson caught the touchdown, but that was it. Curtis Samuel couldn't do anything. Logan Thomas couldn't do anything. This entire team is just... Eh, Got it. Carson Wentz, two interceptions... The play call on that fourth down, that fourth and 15, when Terry McLaurin is all locked up, was ridiculous. That play where Carson Wentz threw it downfield, hoping for something to happen, and then Trayvon Diggs intercepts it, was ridiculous. Ron Rivera's clock management was just terrible. This is just, this game was just all around bad. And the pervert on the, the pervert on the, um, on the yacht isn't going to do anything. So y'all that are saying all oh, this stuff, this stuff is, is got to go. It's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. Cause he's got other things to worry about, which he's not even worried about. He's not worried about the day-to-day functions to his team. He's just sitting there, hum, 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 you know, on his yacht doing God's know what. Probably getting away with other shit. And usually I don't curse on, on my on my channel, but whatever, I don't care. This this game was just awful. This game was terrible. This team is trash. They're absolute garbage. And when I mean garbage, I meant garbage. They should be 0-4 right now. They should be 0-4. Because the Jacksonville Jaguars had that game won. And I had Ed Oliver on this on, on our channel. Um, and I don't know if we were all live yet. I think it was um I think it was backstage. When he said, hey, man, we lose to Dallas, don't worry. We can make it 3-3. Three and three. The Titans and Bears are winnable games. They're winnable games, but are the Commanders going to – are they honestly going to win that game, the, these next two games? Are they really going to go 3-3? Three and three? No. They're going to go 1-5. and five. They're going to go 1-5. On to point number two. Jason – shout out to my guy, Jason Olmio. Good guy. Likes to – you know, we like to bust each other chops a lot. Bro, I don't care what you said in your post-game analysis. I saw what you had to say in your post-game analysis. Shut the f- up, because you were the one, and you and I specifically told you, bro, I better not be hearing that you're excited, because you are the one that said, look, Oscar, the Cowboys are going to be trans. They're going to be winning three. They're going to be one in three. They're going to be 0-4. The Cowboys are trash. Dude, they're three and one. They're three and one, bro. So shut up. Are they gonna pull it off against the Rams? Can Cooper Rush pull it off against the Rams? We'll see. But if they beat the Rams and they're four and one, I shut up. I don't want to hear nothing about your Dallas Cowboys are trash, cause they're not. 
But like I said, we're going to have to wait and see if they can beat the bigger teams. Um, Carson Wentz. I remember, and Jason brought, a good, brought up a good point, that all the Commanders YouTubers basically were very, very red hot with, you know, Carson Wentz. But then, you know, we start, started to think, eh, maybe, maybe. But here's the thing. This is what I said. I was like, maybe. I wasn't getting my hopes up. Because I knew the risk. I knew the risk, and I was red hot. Every Commanders fan was is lukewarm, was lukewarm, and now they're just cold. Ask any Commander YouTuber now or Commander fan on Carson Wentz. Money not well spent, Ron Rivera. Not good going, Ron Rivera. Do you want a cookie for that? Do you want a cookie? Thinking that Carson Wentz was the answer, please. Carson Wentz needs to be benched. The Colts don't need a second round pick. Bench Car Ron Rivera. If you're the good for, if you're not, if you still want to prove that you're a, a somewhat competent guy, bench Carson Wentz for the rest of the year. Put in Sam Howell. Put in Taylor Heineke. I don't give a crap. This defense, Jack Del Rio. Your defense. Made Cooper Rush look like freaking Peyton Manning. Leaving Michael Gallup and CeeDee Lamb open on, on touchdown passes. Really? William Jackson III being scared of being left behind in the dust so he has to hold. That's another thing. This team, you, you talk about culture. Your team was disciplined heading into this game. Yes, they were on a riding a losing streak. But even against the freaking Eagles, even against the Eagles, they weren't penalized as much. 13 penalties, 136 yards of penalties. Really? My goodness, this team is just pathetic. Carson Wentz has got to go. Jahan Dotson got another touchdown pass. Uh, Curtis Samuel was shut down. Um, let me see. This stuff, Trey, Tur Trey Turner, I heard he got benched. See, I hope Dan, Dan Snyder, and I said this, you know, I say maybe he's out on his yacht, but I know he was in Dallas because there was a tweet that him and him and um, uh, Jerry Jones were at the game. Dan Snyder. You brought in Ron Rivera, and Ron Rivera is just bringing in his guys. Bro, that's not – Trey Turner got benched. Um, Everyone else is hot garbage. The game was just terrible. And Jason was like uh, – he was panicking. He was panicking. When the, when the commander scored that touchdown, he was like, ah uh, – your fucking team. This is he was like, this is all your fault. I'm like, bro, it's the commanders. Relax. Cowboys are gonna score on the next drive. Boom. They scored on the next drive and they never look back. Scott Turner, this just play this play call was awful. These this play calling was awful. Jack Dorio doesn't know how to coach his team. If they fire Ron Rivera. Jack Del Rio is going to, and if Jack Del Rio stays, Jack Del Rio is going to be the next best option. And Jack Del Rio as a head coach is not all that good either. Ask, him, ask the Raiders fans. Commanders, at best, are probably going to win one or two more games of the season. They're going to be picking in the top five. Hopefully we learn... I am so done with this coaching stuff. This They need to clean house. Are they going to do it now? No. Like I stated, Dan Snyder is hiding. Dan Snyder is just an owner just to say that he's an owner. He doesn't give a rat's ass about his team. He's an owner just to say he is an owner. Of something. So, it is what it is. 
I told y'all, I, again, I don't know why, I guess, look, I thought that this team was going to be competitive. But I still picked them to go one and three because they're the commanders. They're, they're still Washington. They're still Washington. I said that they're going to go one and three to start. They're one and three, but they're bad. They're bad. And now they're two games behind in the division. And everyone, the Eagles are 4-0. Dallas is 3-1. The Giants are 3-1. Commanders are in fourth place like they should be. Where they always where they always are. So yeah. That's it. That's all. I'm not even gonna do um the good, the bad, the ugly. Nothing was good here. Nothing, everything was bad and ugly. This team this is just a you know shit fest. It's over. It's over. Ron Rivera gets the pink slip at some point this year. I want it to be tomorrow, but I'm not even going to... It's not going to happen tomorrow. It's going to happen... The, I just hope he doesn't last until January. I hope it's at some point during the season. So that way we can already look at head coaching candidates for the following year. Um, But we'll have to wait and see. Anyways, y'all. Commanders are trash. I hope you all agree. Don't tell any, don't let anyone tell you anything different. There's no more hope. If anything, the Titans, they're they're crap right now. They're like what? 2 and 2. They're going to go 3 and 2. It's a winnable game, but the Commanders because they're the Commanders, they're not going to win it. So that's it. That's all. I'm done here. I'm out.